So Kurt, you've been in venture capital for many years now, first as an entrepreneur and operator, mm -hmm. then you started K8 Ventures, and then most recently, you've been the managing partner of 11.2 Ventures, which is a venture builder studio. That's right. So talk to me a bit about what a venture builder studio is. The VBS model evolved recently as a hybrid approach. It's got the attributes of a of a venture firm in that it's got a, a portfolio of companies and it's got the same attributes of an entrepreneur in that it ideates, generates companies and takes those companies to market. So what do you see then as the key advantages of this VBS model? The first is a higher probability of, of individual company level success. The second is a shorter duration or investment window of timeline. The third, the potential for higher returns is greater because in the venture builder studio model, the investor owns more of every single portfolio company. And then the fourth is the diversification that comes with a, uh, a portfolio. So how does this model then avoid the pitfall of uh, many entrepreneurs? 43% of companies fail because their products don't have product market fit. 11.2 ventures sources from the market, from our advisory board, from our industry practice leaders. In addition, we believe that the companies of the future, the great companies of the future are founded on or will have as part of their integral DNA, true artificial intelligence in them. Every company that we're building has AI integrated into the foundation of that particular company. Another stat that's, uh, that's important is you know 22% of companies run out of capital before they can actually get to market. You know we borrow very heavily from some of the best practices in corporate. Those include everything from shared services to success-based stage gate toll gates. This creates tremendous capital efficiency for us as we're building these companies. We build them fast. We build them inexpensively, um, and so our dollar for company creation goes a very long way. So we've talked a lot about the advantages over entrepreneurs. What about the advantages over the traditional VC firm? A venture firm is thin slicing. They're taking a piece of equity in one particular company. And generally, they don't have any control or influence over the direction of that company afterwards. In contrast, uh, the Venture Builder Studio is an operating company. There are no management fees. The VBS itself has 100% equity on the inception date of that company. So, and the VBS also maintains control and direction over that company through the course of its lifetime. So we've covered a lot of ground here. How would you summarize why someone should invest in a venture builder studio like 11.2 Ventures? So four things. First, we're active and engaged and retain control of the companies of every single business that we're in. The second is we're providing investors the potential for greater returns through early stage homegrown companies. The third is we're deploying artificial intelligence, true artificial intelligence to solve broad market problems. And then the fourth, I think if I was to sum it all up is 11.2, we're not just investing in companies, we're building them. Great, thank you, Kurt. <laughs> oh, shoot, okay. <clears throat> Sorry, let's let's start this over. Hi, Kurt. <laughs> Kurt, I understand that you stop me. Oh, Judas Priest.